Hey y'all, welcome. Welcome back to part two of Artistic License. We are going to be catching up on our Sims 2 Pleasant View Rotational. We're going to be checking in on um, on Daniel and Kaylin Pleasant. Daniel and Kaylin Pleasant, um, see what they're up to. They have a new baby, if you remember. They have Jeff. They have Jeff the baby now. Let's see. Okay, here we go. All right. <clears throat> we had moved them last time into this house right here. So uh, here's their description still. Let's see if this needs an update. After divorcing, Daniel has married his mistress. While he may not he, while he may not feel like his Casanova days are behind him, Kaylin has other plans. She wants to start a family and a less stressful job. Um, so that's not exactly accurate anymore. Let's see. Um, so after divorcing, Daniel is, uh, let's see, let's see. Uh, Daniel is again married with child. Um, Kaylin is pursuing her passion <coughs> in the paranormal while raising their baby together. Okay. Yep, that's basically what's happening. So let's let's see what, what they what crazy things these kids get up to. <coughs> She has a lifetime want of graduating three children, so I feel like we, if Kaylin continues to roll like her baby wants, that we should allow her to have three children. So, um, so yeah, she already has the have a baby want again, so we should definitely let her do that. Okay, so we moved them into this house, but I think we did not furnish it or anything yet. Like it looks like like the bat box is still here. Like what the heck? <laughs> what the heck? Um, my gosh. Okay, let's uh. <clears throat> uh i don't think i don't even think we we don't need this like we don't we don't need the bat box uh yeah uh let's see this guy visitor controller we want to change that adjuster oh come here go back to live mode okay we want to change it to uh, what would this be? An oleander? Yeah, an oleander. Okay, what about you? Oh, we don't, we don't even have a lot of counters. Like, oh my gosh, we got to get things going here. Okay, galley kitchen, hate it. Um, hate it. <laughs> Let's see, okay. Um, <clears throat> here's the upstairs. There's the master. So they've got, they've got a lot of small rooms going on in this house. I think I must have picked it on purpose thinking about like Kaylin and her three kids. So, uh, so yeah, let's, um, let's get something going for them. So they need a bed. They need a bed. Um, maybe they don't have the most expensive bed yet. Maybe we just get them a regular bed. We can always upgrade later. Okay. Uh, bed has to go like this. That's like the only choice they get. Um, <clears throat> we need to make a baby room. Let's do that. Just keep the standard. They need the standard changing table too. Yes. Okay. Um, I feel like it should be I like the wood paneling and stuff. Yeah, it looks nice. It's just it's small. It's a small house for what they're gonna what they're trying to do. But you know, it is what it is. This is they they upgraded for sure, um, because they went from a condo to this. So, <coughs> excuse me. All right, let's get them the this. They're gonna need this. Um, all right. I think that that's okay. Oh wait. They definitely need a dining room. Well, sh Let's move you outside. Uh, you, I really want you on a counter. Oh, but we could put you up there. If we put two things up there, we can put two things up there. So actually, why don't we put these guys both up there? Why, wait, why can't you go? You can't go up there. That's unfortunate. Well, you can. I guess I'll just put you outside for now. Okay. Um, and it's supposed to be Thursday, 
spring. Yes, I must have already set that to Thursday spring. Okay. All right. So I've got that. Yeah, and then we've got one, two, three child bedrooms. So yeah, okay. No, this is good. This is good. So maybe we've got a boy's room, a girl's room, and like a little playroom down here or something. Yeah. Okay. So you can put Jeff in the crib. And um, why don't y'all why don't y'all christen your new house? Let's christen the new house and try for baby. What does he want? Oh, he wants to get fit. Oh, I need to get him an exercise machine for sure. Fitness is his hobby, right? Also? I mean, I know he's an assistant coach, but I think fitness is also his hobby. No, it's sports. It's sports. But I think... Let's see. <coughs> oh, oh, they brought a bunch of stuff over. I forgot about that. Okay, wait. His punching bag... He can have like a little gym area outside. That's cute. Okay, they can have their little their little mole wrap. Their little mole wrap. I don't know if it's gonna make me restock it. I actually didn't need this stuff. Oh, and their date flowers. Oh, how sweet. Let's just put those right there for now. We didn't need these. Did I put anything in Kaylin's inventory? Just those flowers, okay. I forgot I put stuff in his inventory. Okay, let's turn you around. <clears throat> Alright, go relax, Kaylin. We're going to try for baby. Oh, I need to replace that tub with a shower. All right, let's see if we can do it. Let's see. <coughs> Come on, baby chimes. Baby chimes. Baby chimes? Nope. No baby chimes. Okay. Well, she wants to reach charisma level three. Let's get them a little mirror. There we go. Get rid of this guy. I'm not gonna just have them taking baths all the time. They can take showers. They don't need the most expensive shower. This should be good. Here we go. That's a nice shower. All right, so Kaylin, come here and practice your speech. You don't need to sleep. It's 9 a.m. What do you want to do? <coughs> he wants to raise his creativity. Why? You don't need to. Okay, he wants to get fit. Why don't you come out here then and punch? He wants to adopt a cat or a dog. He wants to obtain a pet. You're gonna, you're about to have three babies. I think the little worm rat is plenty pet for you. Oh, he can't. I must have put it in a bad spot. Try this. Maybe I need to put it in the backyard. Oh, why don't I just? I'll just put it out here. I'll just put it out here. Now I'm pretty sure he can use it. Go punch. Yeah, I think that's what they're called, right? The worm rats? Am I wrong? I'm, I don't know. Now I'm like questioning, but I think they're called worm rats. <coughs> the little like hamster things. All right. Enthusiasm for sports. Okay. So why don't you stop? I don't know if that was enough to get you fit. Hey, there we go. He got fit. Yeah. You're back in shape, my dude. You're back in shape. Go use the bathroom.
Ooh, they want to woohoo again. Or he wants to woohoo. Yeah, woohoo in bed. Okay. We're going to do that. We're going to try for baby again. We're going to try for baby again. <coughs> what is this? A charisma. Why do you want another charisma point? I guess because she's family knowledge. She should want a creativity point, whatever. She wants to buy a birdcage, buy a bookcase. So we can definitely buy a bookcase. Okay, after they try for baby, though, Daniel needs to go take care of his child. <laughs> the existing one. See, they're across the street from the goths now. Look at that. Move it on up. Okay, so we're going to do try for baby. Let's see. Chimes? Maybe. <laughs> Maybe, baby. <gasps> yes! Okay, pregnant again. Pregnant again. Heck yeah. Okay, don't go to sleep, guys. Um... Daniel, you need to come down here and uh, take care of your child. Your child needs diaper change. Kaylin, you can serve some lunch. Uh, why don't you serve some lunch meat sandwiches? They need a table, too, and they want a bookcase, so I should probably get them that as well. Okay, let's get, get the bookcase. Let's get one that's pretty normal looking. Get this one. <coughs> Excuse me. Maybe I shouldn't have put all that cheese on my food. Like clear my throat like crazy. Okay, let's get a dining room table. Yep, let's get a typical table. Let's get some dining room chairs. Just get some regular ones. Doesn't have to be anything super fancy. Brown one. There we go. Then we can get get a high chair. They definitely would have a high chair. With all the bibbas they're gonna be having. <coughs> okay, this is a little bit better. This is looking a little bit better. Still do not have enough counter space in that kitchen. Holy cannoli. Like, three counters. Three little counters. That's not enough. Let's see, can I put this on top of the bookshelf? Can you put objects on top of the bookshelf? Doesn't look like it. See this though? Oh, I just realized they don't have a dishwasher either. We should probably get them that. Dishwasher. Yeah, dishwasher. There we go. Yeah, dishwasher. Oh, I should have got them the yellow. Oh, it's a yellow kitchen. For some reason, I thought it was a green kitchen. Hang on. Oh, yeah. Yellow. <coughs> there we go. Now it matches the stove. All right. Daniel, come eat your sandwich. Let's see, get creativity level one. Does he need it? I don't know. He doesn't. I don't know why he's doing that. All right, eat, guys. Have another sandwich. Two sandwiches. Oh, Kaylin coming. Work. 
All right. She's got work to go to. Since they're going to have three kids, they probably should hire a maid. I think we might do that. They need a phone. That's right, they don't have a phone. I did learn that. I'm trying to call him. Let's get a smoke detector. Let's get a burglar alarm. And let's get a phone. Jeff's birthday is only two days away. Oh, and so is Daniel's. Okay, invite someone over. Answer the phone. Why aren't you answering? There we go. Oh, yeah, it's Herb. Uh, stay here, but you can come over. Let's see, call Sim. Don't take a bubble bath. Come on now. You got things to do. You want to invite someone over? Oh, we just recently... What about John, though? Wow, Dustin hates him. Ah, <laughs> oh, Dustin. Okay, wait. Will John Burb come over? I want them to be friends. Yes, your friend can come over, too. Okay. Let's do... Service? And we are going to need a maid. Let's do... Which is made. Since Kaylin lives here, I wonder if it'll let us hire Kaylin. Oh no, it doesn't. Good, good, good. Okay, we're gonna hire Lucy Hanby though. Yes. Okay. Let's see, who's he gonna bring? Why don't you get the mail while you're waiting? Oh, it's Malcolm! Uh -huh. Why are you being so sneaky? Oh, he's closer to friends with uh, John Burb here. Let's do a hangout. Eleganda. Yes, I know. There we go. We'll do a hangout. Try to make a friend. Yay, we made a friend. Okay. Oh, he wants to talk to Mary Sue. Aww. <coughs> By a dresser? Okay, well, anyways, they're friends now. Your baby's hungry. So let's, um, hold Jeff. <laughs> Malcolm just comes over to play with my pets. Isn't that a true friend? Okay, let's get a dresser. You want one, so... Oh no, dressers in miscellaneous, that's right. Gotta cost at least a thousand. Nine hundred. Oh, here we go. What are these? Oh, little weird closets, okay. I think he wants this armoire. What I'm gonna guess. We're gonna do that. It fits there perfectly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Oh, and he wants to talk to Nina. He did have a little little thing, little thing thing going on with Nina. Fascinated by the by the worm rat. <laughs> Okay, they have disparate schedules, so... Oh, we shouldn't have to have a nanny, I don't think. I don't think we need to have a nanny. Alright, Jeff, you can go back in the crib. Let's call Nina. He wants to. He wants to talk to her. <laughs> Nina, hello. Let's just talk. <laughs> it's kind of messed up. He got a little flirty, flirty thing going on with Nina whenever uh, Nina and Mary Sue are together. Kind of messed up. Just saying. <laughs> <coughs> Gosh, Kaylin's so much younger than, than Daniel here. 20 days, and he's about to become an elder. He wants to talk to Mary Sue. I'm gonna have, her, have him call Mary Sue right after. I, like, pretend that, that Nina's like, he's like, oh, can I talk to Mary Sue? And he, like, covertly passes her the phone. Okay, let's do call them. I know it's a new call, but we're pretending. We're gonna pretend that's what happens. All right, where is she? Mary Sue. Oh, there she is. I forgot she's old now. And I was thinking of seeing like the black hair, but no, she's got white hair now. Oh, he needs to change shift. <laughs> Sorry, Mary Sue. I have to go change my son's diaper. Oh. <clears throat> Kaylin's home. Okay, wow, her needs are so tanked. Alright, come up here. Get clean. What is that? How did someone spill whatever? What did y'all spill on the carpet? At least we have a maid coming, so it's gonna be okay. Wait, why is he Oh my gosh, Lunar, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, I so appreciate it, friend. Man, everything's wonderful when you're friends with Lunar. I'm so glad you had a good day today also. I'm having a good day too. Good days for everybody. So we're actually going to be playing this this game right here, The Sims 2 Pleasant View Rotational, all uh, next Sunday. Because I want to try to finish round three before we move on to a new game. So that's going to be something that we do. Working so much overtime, I got to spoil my friends. <laughs> Today's on my side. Yesterday was not. I understand. I understand. I'm so sorry your internet is still having like all kinds of trouble. Like, have you tried? Do you think it's time to call your ISP again? Um, I don't know, like, my internet was kind of weak at the old house, and so I had, like, an uh, ethernet cord, like, running across the house so that I could have wired internet. Um, do you have yours wired or wireless? It makes me wonder, like, with what you're experiencing with, like, what I experienced, um, with trying to do it on wireless. It just didn't really work.
Okay, he's got to go to work today. <clears throat> he should definitely have a sandwich. Try to have a sandwich before you go to work, Daniel. Yeah, come grab a plate. Wake up. Time to get up. Oh, she's still hungry. Wait. Get another sandwich. I plugged in Wi-Fi booster in my room and connected that to my computer. Did a test stream. It was stable the whole time. Oh my gosh. Okay. Well, hopefully the booster fixes it and then you're going to be good to go. That would be amazing. And you wouldn't have to worry. Bye. Have fun at work, Daniel. Damn, Danielle. Oh, she wants to kiss him. Aw, that's so nice. Okay, what's this? She wants to get a charisma skill point. Oh, time to time to feed the baby, I bet. Yeah, she's gonna feed the baby. We need a mirror in this bathroom too. We should have multiple mirrors. It's weird to have a bathroom with no mirror, you know? Even if it's this little crappy one. Put one in this one. Too. There. So, Kaylin, how's it feel to go from being a maid to having a maid? How's that feel? I hope it feels pretty good. I'm going to do a little test streams this week before Friday. It's probably a good idea. Before you do your actual plan stream, you know? So that you cannot have the issues during it. Like just little ones where it's like whatever and it doesn't matter. Alright, Jeff can go in the crib. You can use the bathroom. So <clears throat> She got pregnant so quick after. We'll see how this goes. I want her. I think she. I want her to have three babies like in a row as much as she can. Lucy, hello. center because of where the window is though like it should be a couch and a chair but like, let's put a lazy boy next to it that helps so, like put the couch here Do 
I not know how to use this object rotator? Yes, I don't. Yeah, I thought she put the objects on top of it and then it would like do it, but it's not working. Can't delete an object with something on it. What? Yeah, I guess I don't know how to use that. I have this thing, but I think I don't know how to use it. I was trying, I wanted to do like a corner rotation with this thing, but I think I, I don't think I know how. Oh well, it's fine. It's fine like that. Okay, what are we doing? Oh, we're changing the diaper. Okay. Why don't you answer the phone? Is Daniel? No. Daniel's not available to talk. Oh, oh shoot, I didn't turn off stupid visitors. I don't, I don't really want you there. You can definitely reach that toilet. I don't know what your issue is. If you want to use the bathroom, you can. I guess the writing in the diary is what's fun for her. Hey, Daniel got a promotion. Good job, Daniel. Good job. He might actually become a Hall of Famer. What? Has brought a new video game. Okay. So he also bought a video game. Okay, he wants to talk about his hobby. To talk about hobby sports. He wants to kiss him. Let's do that. Like, yeah, sports, uh-huh. Sure. Absolutely, sports. Yes, let's kiss. Okay, charisma. Let's go, let's go practice your friends. Okay, she wants... Oh, gosh, she, uh... Needs to serve some food. Let's do something more substantial. Let's get some hamburgers. Oh, hey, baby bump. Oh my gosh. Oh, and she's got the black ones. Oh, nice. Okay. Um, let's. You definitely need some food, honey. Let's do. Um. Oh. She wants to go take a bubble bath. Okay, I understand. You can do it because you're pregnant. And then after that, you need to fix some food. Make some hamburgers. The baby wants a hamburger. I should get in touch with Daniel. It's been a while. We, I literally just saw you yesterday, my dude. Just saw you yesterday. It's not been a while. Kaylin makes such a cute pregnant lady. So real. Yeah, Kaylin, you're gonna eat both of those hamburgers. I don't know who you're fooling. I think that's for Daniel. No way, Jose. Eat that one too. Can't afford to let your hunger knee get low at all. Oh, Daniel's gonna grow up in just one day. Okay, Daniel, I need you to stop that. Sorry, you gotta put away the leftovers. Aw, Daniel hold him. That was cute. She passed him over to Daniel. He about to grow up? Is that what's happening? 
Her fun is very low. Let's go watch some TV. What's her hobby? She's so tired. Go to sleep. Go to sleep, honey. It's okay. I wanted to get your fun up, but it's not gonna happen. It's not gonna happen. All right, put Jeff in the crib. You can practice speech a little bit more before bedtime. Oh, why? Oh, it's his it's his birthday. That's that is why. Your energy's too low, honey. You need to go to bed. You can come hold him. Daniel can come hold him. Hopefully it'll turn into a help with birthday. Although I have had this struggle before, where they just the birthday just will never will never get here. They like do this for hours. Okay, she's sleeping good. I'll let it let it get a little bit later. My gosh, that lightning is crazy. started a fire. Uh-oh. The rain will put it out, though. Since it's raining at the same time. I guess you got on stay up with the baby duty, huh? Okay. Well, he gives up on that. Um, why don't you then come take a shower and go to bed? Does it help with birthday again? It's help with birthday again. And it's not happening for some reason. Oh, gained a point of cleaning. Okay. What if we get a cake? I guess if we let's if we try to do this official. Let's see. Let's go to the party. Try to get a cake. Then if we do Kaylin, bring Jeff to cake. Let's just speed this along. It's Daniel's birthday today too anyways, so we'll have to get two cakes, I guess. We can't do the bring to cake for both. All right, let's see what kind of child Jeff is. Come on. This child's not growing up. Remember this happened before. I don't understand how to, what to do when this happens. I guess I'll just let her stand there for a bit. <clears throat> I hope he's gonna eat some cake. Oh, you need to clean the cage. All right, well, we're still having troubles. Let's eat some cake. Oh, there we go. Now it worked. Hey, that's cute. All right, put Jeff down, grab a plate. Yes, they have cake. He looks like Daniel. Oh my God, this baby looks so much like Daniel. That's crazy. You should have a plate too. All right, Kaylin, you probably need some real food, but we're gonna have more cake. We're, we're a waste not want not type of family. Let's see. Are you still hungry? Oh no, you gotta go to work.
Okay, so we need to take care of your needs, Kaylin. Let's uh shower. All right, how's the baby doing? Baby is definitely gonna need diaper change. There's no way Kaylin's gonna make it in time for doing a potty training. We should probably put a bathtub downstairs. Should probably put a bathtub downstairs. Will one fit? One fit. Just get the same one. Oh, we can't fit a sink and a toilet and bathtub in there. It really is only a half bath. That's a shame. They can have a toilet, but they can't also have a sink. I don't want to expand it. Like, it, there's room to expand into this room. I'm doing it. I'm changing it. They're going to need a bathtub downstairs. They're just going to need it. God for the maid. All right, let's put Jeff in the crib. You need a nap. And, uh, Kaylin, maybe you should eat some more cake. Your hunger is dipping again. Gosh, being pregnant with a toddler is hard. <laughs> no, the maid will get that. It's okay. You get your fun up. Thank you. Thank you, Lucy. Okay. We're good now. We can uh, let Jeff out. We can play, and we can actually go to sleep. We're going to take a nap. Um, let's get some toys. Now that he's a toddler, let's get some toys. We definitely need one of these. Yeah, when you want those, you want these, and uh, let's see, when you want these, but like, then where's the toilet go? I guess we can put the potty training toilet in that bathroom. How do we can it? Okay, get toys in there. Oh wait, did he want one of those toys? Oh, I don't know. He must have wanted a toy. Oh, he got the teddy bear pajamas. That's so cute. <gasps> Hello. Welcome in, Raiders. Oh my gosh, Moisty. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you for the raid. Um, Wait, we got to do a shout out for Moisty. We got to do a shout out. If you guys are not following a Moist Goat, what the heck are you doing with your life? Oh my gosh. Um, What were you playing? How was your stream? There we go. All right, Raiders. Um, Welcome in, by the way. My name is... Oh my god, I did the wrong one. I did the wrong a Moist Goat. I didn't do the... Uh, let's do the other kind of shout out for you. Um, underscore. It's under a underscore. I always forget the, the second underscore. I'm sorry. I'm terrible. There we go. There's the other kind of shout out. That's the moist goat you should follow. Not the first one. 
Oh my gosh, thank you so much for the follow, Friendo. We've got um we've got anonymous followers on here, but if you want to say hello, then I'll be happy to thank you uh, with your name. Watch the Xbox Showcase and announce that I'm retiring. Oh, you're retiring? You don't want to stream anymore? I know you haven't been streaming a lot lately, but that's sad. No more moisty streams? Is that real? Oh, is that boy. real? I'm going to take a look at the um, a Xbox Showcase after I'm done streaming. Shit. <laughs> your streams are awesome, Whoa, my dude. I'm man, sorry. That that's, I'm that's sorry that painful. that's happening. I hope that hair, means, though, that like face. work is really it's taking off for you or something, and is, you're like busy with that. Is that what that means? So, Raiders, by the way, um, my name is Karen Terry. I'm a variety but streamer. We stream a lot of like games with good stories. So, like, we just finished a 100% run through of Majora's Mask. We're going to be streaming um, a new game starting soon, but we stream a lot of Sims 2 as well because we make our own stories in Sims 2. The dreams come to an end. I go through at the start of the VOD. I want you, if you want to look. Okay, I will. I will go look. I will go look. I will go look. Well, I'm sorry you're retiring. I will miss I will miss you in the streaming landscape. Um, you had You had good stuff. You had really good stuff. I understand, though. I kind of feel like, you know, like when King's retired or whatever, you know, like sometimes you got to do what you got to do. So I understand. And uh, and I know that someday I'll probably be done with the streaming hobby as well, but not today and not for a long time. Hopefully I've still got lots more I like I want to share with you guys. So, yeah, that's a little bit about me um raiders so if that sounds good to you if you like if you like good stories then you should definitely drop me a follow because that's the type of thing that you'll find here so we play a lot of like rpgs we also do a media analysis podcast like right now my um co-host and i are reading hunger games we just did our catching fire episode yesterday and um next month i think probably we're going to be doing our mocking jay episode um we're going to analyze all the movies and then we're going to also read the new book the um ballad of songbirds and snakes so gonna be it's gonna be it's a real good time it's a real good time um other things that we're gonna be doing this year in regards to that is uh we're gonna be reviewing sailor moon cosmos when that comes out in the u.s it just came out in japan the other day but whenever we get are able to get um some sort of version of it in the u.s we will be uh doing a analysis of that we've done analysis of all the other sailor moon crystal um if you like anime other anime we've done is cowboy bebop and death note so yeah, if any of that's your jam, that's what you can find here. And it's a real good time. We're really super friendly and um, we try to make sure everybody feels welcome. So uh, so it's that type of environment here. Oh my God, never hear from you. Dude, we just talked two days ago. We just talked two days ago. <clears throat> oh. Oh, third baby bump, third baby bump. Okay, well, you can be done with your nap then, Kaylin. Why don't you come down here and have a hamburger? Why don't you come down here and have a hamburger? All right. Um. Ooh, what are we gonna name the next kid? Okay, wait. We have to pick out a. We have to pick out a name. We have to pick out a name. Um. Let's look at the family tree. Look at the family tree. Oh, I know what we should do. I know what we should do. How do we make Moist Goat into a human name? We should name the baby after Moisty. How do we how do we make Moist Goat a human name? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if your um if your real name is like public or okay to say Moisty. Um I can't remember for you. <laughs> what's uh what's the case with that? So uh but we should try to think of a way that Moisty can be like a human name like we should name the baby like Matthew or Maria or something. Gibby. Oh, Gibby. Oh, Gibby's not bad. Gibby and Gibby could work for a boy or a girl, huh? So that's pretty good. I like that idea. All right. Why don't you put away the leftovers, Daniel? When we need to do a potty train and then let's do a potty train for Jeff. And then we need to have Daniel's birthday because he's going to be an elder. So after you eat, you can clean this up and we'll buy a new cake and we'll do Daniel's birthday. Gibby. I like that though. I like that. We usually pick from the family tree of either of either the parents, you know, their their like ancestors or whatever, but I think in this case in this case it's appropriate to say Gibby. Makiko! All right, empty that before we forget. 
Okay, and let's get a new cake. Party. All right, and then you can blow out the candles. Come blow out the candles. Yes, more cake. More cake. Your husband's about to become a sexy old man. Yeah! Party in the pants. Party in, in her pants. <clears throat> I should have gotten her dress before it was party time, but I didn't. She doesn't need it. Yeah! Okay, let's see what kind of old person Daniel is. <laughs> he looks the same, just with white hair. That's crazy. He looks the same. He looks the same. Okay. Oh, let's see who else. Yeah, let's age him up. Um, let's age up. Yeah, let's age up some Sims. Yep. Yep, Daniel's an elder now. All right, you can... Oh, you're using the bathroom. Okay. Her energy is kind of low. Ooh, well. Mechanical skill point, creativity skill point. Do you need any skill points? You don't need any skill points. I'm really not worried about your skill points right now. <clears throat> Let's see. What does he want? Snuggled by Kaylin, snuggled by Daniel. Okay. We can definitely snuggle. You should probably clean up the cake. Buy a car. Gain a charisma skill point. Oh yeah, he is still working on his charisma. Learn to walk? Okay, we can try doing some learn to walk. Oh, not to we want to do walk. There we go. Let's do yeah. Teach Jeff to walk. That's the one he wanted? Yeah, he wants to learn to walk. There we go. We'll do some of that until they get tired. Why did she decide she had to go shower? Oh, I guess she was too uncomfortable. Huh, I don't know. Well, you should put him in the crib. And then go to bed. See if he can get the point before he's too tired and it's time to go to bed. There we go. Okay, he got one. Then you can go to bed too. Bedtime for everybody. Why is there a dog on my front porch? Go away. What are you doing here? Tramp? Ramp? Is that an alpha or is that just... It's an alpha. It's an alpha. It's an alpha. That's why. Because <clears throat> Kaylin has that secondary knowledge. Oh, now that he's an elder, let's check. Let's check this. Oh, no. No, neither of them. What about you? Oh, yeah. Okay. Let's get some of these. That should be helpful. You can get out on your own, don't worry. I have the mod. If you stress about it enough, you'll just climb out on your own. Hungry? Oh, he's too hungry. Okay, well, hers is all the way up. Let's uh, get a bottle for him. Oh, he's up at 4 a.m. too. the bottle down he'll come to it outside Kaylin what are you doing why are you putting the bottle down outside oh my god and here comes the baby you can't even get down the stairs Kaylin where are you going Kaylin 
She's gonna loop around the whole house. Before she finds where she wants to put this bottle down at. Just put it down and I'll move it for you. Oh, she's throwing it away? Kaylin, why? Kaylin, why did you throw it away? My god. Get him a bottle. CPS is gonna come because of the pathing. The heck. Kaylin, just put it down, please. Yeah, I know. I know he's facing the wall. It is okay. Just put it down. Okay. Drink the fucking milk. My god. There. Jesus. Insanity. Okay, is he full? No, but that's okay. We're gonna give him a bath after we shower. Oh, no, because he's gonna ask Daniel for a diaper change. Oh. <laughs> okay, don't worry, he'll do it. wants to buy a car they really I guess they could put a driveway right there on the edge it's because of this this like bank right here they really don't have a good spot for a driveway their house is kind of up on a little hill like up on a little hill right, hill right there all right you can use the bathroom wait or you can't oh that was him okay oh she's hungry let's get some leftovers our interaction. He wants to say goodbye to him. <laughs> what wants does he have? Walk and talk? <laughs> Teach him to walk. Oh, why didn't it work? Teach him to walk. Stop watching TV. You stop playing with your shape game. He's too tired. She's gonna have that baby any second. She's gonna have that baby any freaking second. another hamburger. I just I don't want her needs to get too low because it'll be so hard to get back up. Needs to go nap. Get a bottle for Jeff. There we go. Hey, that one went really smoothly. Alright, light train. Maybe we can. Oh no, he barely. He's barely. This poor child. This poor child! 
Daniel's home. You deserve a hamburger left over too. So you can have one. All right, Kaylin, how are we doing? Oh, she's got to go to sleep. She's going to sleep so early. So early. Yay, she has the day off today. Okay. So let's try again with teaching Jeff to walk. He wants to learn so badly. I knew it. I knew it was going to be any second. Oh, he teleported upstairs. He teleported upstairs just to be with her for this. Oh, my God. Okay. Um, Daniel. It's the last name. Was it the last name? Huh? What? Look at this baby. Oh my gosh. Oh, another another one with um Daniel Pleasant's coloring. Oh, it's a baby boy. Okay, yes. Baby boy Gibby. Okay, yes. I love that it's a boy. I love that. Okay, Gibby. Yes. Oh, yay. So cute. Why is there a nanny? Why is the nanny, that nanny here? She shouldn't be. Okay. Okay, let's go back to trying to do the teach Jeff to walk. Don't do that. Oh, oh, we need another crib. Oh, we're gonna need, we need another crib. Okay. Um, yeah, because he's a toddler. Okay. Um, do we have, what are the beds? What's the bed situation? Yeah, Gibby. anymore. It's two more days. Okay, so we're gonna need a second crib most likely. So let's get let's get another crib. Just for temporary. Just for temporary. Oh I accidentally did the talk. We're we're trying to teach him to walk. Jeff wants to learn how to walk. He doesn't care about talking. He cares about walking. He wants he wants to scooch around. He wants to do an oop scoot. He wants to buy a better bookcase. Well, baby Gibby, why don't you um why don't you go in the crib? Buy a drum kit, buy a bass. They always want to buy all the instruments. Why don't you serve a chef salad? Now we've got a baby and a toddler. Oh my gosh. What is the sign for this toddler anyways? Let's see. Um, where's his personality? There it is. He's a Pisces. Okay. Baby Jeff is a Pisces. Nope, I didn't mean to click that. Oh, there's one more hamburger left. I didn't even realize. Game off. Don't want eat. Come on, Lati. I bet he's a doll. Come on, taste of what? Go. No, let me see me, Dickie. 
already. Why don't you put away leftovers before you eat? What? That would be a good idea. Now you can eat. Oh, hey, we did it. He learned to walk. Okay, you should put leftovers away. Oh, and then we need to do a potty tree. All right, we're trying to potty train this child. I don't know if it's gonna work. At least he can walk though. So that's good. Okay, let's buy them a car. I wanna do that. Get a driveway first. Driveway, there we go. Driveway. Yeah, I can go on the edge of the lot like that. That's fine. Looks a little weird, but that's okay. That's okay. It's not bad. Okay, let's buy a car. We're just going to get them the regular car. I don't think they would have anything too crazy. And they've got some crazy paint jobs, though. But maybe this blue paint job. It's like, it, we're, we're going to pretend that this is a fancy car with this racing stripe. He wants to buy a vacation home. Oh, my God. Daniel, calm down. Okay, let's put Jeff in his crib over there. She's already asleep. Oh, wait, we gotta change to Gibby's diaper. Stop going to look at your car. You got things to do. You have you have babies. You have babies. All right, put Gibby in the crib. <laughs> Need to give Gron some food. <laughs> you should probably go to bed too. Let's get him their charisma point. Well, let's see how much charisma. It's midnight. Go to sleep. Which child is up? Oh, Jeff is up. I guess that makes sense. Gibby can't get herself up yet. She's still a baby. Musical skills. Oh, she's thinking about adopting? Oh, honey. Oh, honey. I'm just waiting for you to roll that want for another one. That's all. That's all we're waiting for. All right, it's 6 a.m. Monday, summer. That's end of this particular this particular one. Um, so for everybody watching the VOD on YouTube, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe below. And of course, as always, don't forget to make it a great day.